So at this time, I'd like the children to please come forward for a special blessing. Boys and girls, as we celebrate the Easter season, when we celebrate Jesus' resurrection from the dead, we ask a blessing upon you that your hearts and your minds be open to his word. And we ask this blessing upon you now in the name of the Father and of the Son and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Welcome back to another Children's Liturgy lesson, lesson at St. Cecilia's Parish. I hope you guys are enjoying this beautiful day. Before we get started, I'm going to light the candle to remind us that Jesus is always with us. He's the light of the world. Last week was the sixth Sunday of Easter. And you were told about how Jesus wanted his disciples and his friends and us to be friends with each other. Let's stand and listen to God's word. Do you want to join with me in saying our joy word three times? Do you remember what that joy word is? Does it start with an A maybe? I think you've got it. Let's do it together. Let's cheer. Alleluia, alleluia, alleluia. Now let's listen to God's word. A reading from the Holy Gospel according to Mark. Glory to you, Lord. Jesus said to his friends, I want you to go and tell others what I have told you. Everyone who believes in me should be baptized and become my disciple. I will be with you always. Then Jesus went up into heaven his disciples did what Jesus had asked them. They told the good news and talked about Jesus everywhere they went. This is from the Gospel of the Lord. Praise to you, Lord Jesus Christ. All right, let's have a seat. <clears throat> so today, Jesus went to his friends, the disciples, and said he had some sad news, that he was going to leave them. Now, today is the ascension of Jesus. Do you know what ascension means? It's a pretty big word. Hmm. It sounds like going up. So Jesus is going up to heaven. That's what ascension means. The disciples can hardly believe their ears. They're really sad because Jesus is their friend and he's going to go away for a little bit. But Jesus looks at them and he says, I have a job for you guys. They're like, tell us, Jesus, what's our job? We'll try to do it. Telling is the job, answers Jesus. Tell my good news about God the Father's love for all people. Show the good news, too, by the way you live. Hmm, how do I show the good news? That seems like a pretty tall order. How about, what do you think? Being kind to others? Does that seem like you're sending, spreading Jesus' good news? How about sharing our toys with our friends and our siblings? How about we spread joy by doing nice things for others? After Jesus told them to spread the good news, they said to him, it'll be hard to do that without you here, Jesus. We want you to be with us when we try. But Jesus said, even though you can't see me, I will help you and will always be with you. I'm going to heaven now, and I'll send you a surprise. Wait for the surprise, the gift. Oh, that's so hard, they said. We can hardly wait. Now, you'll have to wait until next week to hear what the surprise is. So maybe do some thinking about what that surprise might be. Now I have a job for you this week. Do you think you can do it? I want you to do something nice for someone else. 
And not because I'm asking you to do it, it's because you want to do it and no one's telling you to do it. This is how we share Jesus' good news. We do nice, positive things for others and we spread joy. Now, let's stand up and say a few prayers. How does that sound? For all of us here, that we showed the good news by our actions, we pray to the Lord. Lord, hear our prayer. For doctors and nurses who work with the sick, we pray to the Lord. Lord, hear our prayer. Now, let's take a few minutes. We're going to close our eyes and we're going to think about what else we can pray for. We pray to the Lord. Lord, hear our prayer. Now, let's put our hands together and pray the prayer that Jesus taught us. Can you do that with me? All right. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. Lead us not into temptation, and deliver us from evil. Amen. Thank you so much. You guys did such a great job. Now, I want you to invite you to spend a few more minutes looking at the art that was submitted from last week's lesson. And I also want to invite you to do another picture and submit it to my art at saintcecilia.com. This is my rendition of Jesus going up to heaven. And it says on it, I will always be with you. Thank you so much for joining me today. Have a wonderful day. God bless.